welcome to the players to watch episode for game week 25. First up is Andy Carroll. With the upcoming blank game weeks approaching in game weeks 26 and 28, it's important to consider players who have guaranteed fixtures during those game weeks. West Ham's Andy Carroll not only falls into this category, but he's also shown good form in recent weeks, with four goals scored in his last six Premier League games. Admittedly, the goals have come from only four shots on target during their last six game weeks, but the West Ham striker has taken a total of 14 shots during that period, with 11 coming from inside the area, so he is getting into the right positions, it seems. One thing to note, however, is that Carroll is a slight doubt ahead of game week 25. Slavan Bilic remains hopeful that the West Ham striker will be able to return for the weekend, but if you are looking to bring him in, it's best to hang on until after the press conference later this week for assurances on his fitness. In game week 25, the Hammers host the West Brom side that have failed to win either of their last two away games, conceding five goals in the process. The next player to watch is Gylfi Sigurdsson. The Iceland international was close to rescuing a point for his side last game week when his 81st minute strike temporarily leveled up the scoreline against Man City. That goal means that Sigurdsson has now scored in each of his last three Premier League games against Southampton, Liverpool and Man City. Swansea have started to turn things around under Paul Clement, their three wins from their last five games have seen them move out of the relegation zone. During that run, they've scored a total of eight goals, and Gilfie Sigurdsson has been directly involved in five of them, scoring three and providing two assists. His set-piece duties and guaranteed fixtures in game weeks 26 and 28 further enhance the appeal of the £7.4 million midfielder. Up next for Swansea is a home game against a Leicester side that have conceded 10 goals during the last four game weeks. Only Bournemouth have conceded more goals over the same period. Next up is Mikhail Antonio. The attacking midfielder is West Ham's top goal scorer this season, with 8 goals and 6 assists to his name so far. West Ham have scored 9 goals during the last four game weeks, which is level with Chelsea, and only Everton have scored more goals over that period. In the last six game weeks, Antonio has provided four assists for the Hammers, whilst producing nine attempted assists and taking four shots on target. Since the departure of Dimitri Payet, Mikhail Antonio has been playing as a second striker alongside Andy Carroll in a 4-4-2 system, giving him an out-of-position factor. Priced at only £7 million, he's another strong option to consider for those looking to improve their teams long term, with fixtures against West Brom, Watford, Bournemouth, Leicester and Hull over the next six game weeks, and a guarantee of no blank game weeks. And the final player to watch for this game week is Ramiro Funes Mori. Priced at only £4.7 million, the Argentinian provides a cheap way into an Everton defence that has kept three clean sheets during the last six game weeks. Their six goals conceded over that period ranks them joint third in the Premier League, behind only Man United and Spurs. Everton assets are becoming very important at the moment, due to their strong upcoming fixtures and guarantee of no blank game weeks. Over the next five game weeks, they'll host Sunderland, West Brom and Hull. Up next for Everton is an away trip to a Middlesbrough side that have failed to win any of their last seven Premier League games. Over that period, they've scored just three goals, only Leicester have scored fewer. 